Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. I'm continuing my playthrough of the SNES classic, The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, and now return you to the next episode, currently in progress. Awesomeness awaits. All right, and we're back. Uh, just kind of taking a little inventory here. So we got our bows and arrows, we got our upgraded boomerang. I don't know if you notice in the bottom right hand corner where it says equipment, there's a one next to the sword. That's because we're at the first level sword. That, that'll that go up, up to four. We got a red shield now, which blocks a little bit more. There's a couple more shields and we've got the green armor, which will get upgraded as we go. And we've got only a quarter piece of heart for the moment. And down on the bottom left where it says do, the things that'll happen when you push the A button, so lift two means we're at the second strength level for lift. There is a third when we get the next glove. And then read, talk, pull, run. And now we also have swim because we got the magic flippers. Um, just one of those things to, to kind of notice as you go. Uh, I Real talk. Uh, let's get back to here. Um, if you remember, in the far southeast where there was a cave that we got the ice rod and on the other side there was a couple of fairies oh and don't let me forget i got the third bottle i need to go collect another fairy to to deal with that or to fill that bottle um inside that cave if you dash into the statue of the fairy you'll find a good bee now, you can do a couple of different things with this good bee. Uh, you know what? I'm not that far away. The good bee will fight for you, like other bees. Uh, what's different, though, is that he will... Um, he will also help you find an item later. So I may pick him up later when we get there. Yeah, I'll, I'll pick him up later when we get there. And I'll, I'll get into this more when we get there, because I, I, oh, I'm so tired of backtracking. All right. I, I also need to remember to head into the swamp off camera to uh, to pick up uh, all the loads of rupees that are down there. <sighs> so I can spend them all in the wishing well on bomb and arrow capacity. What I'm going to do is I'm going to head to the north for the third pendant. I'm... I might be able to get... Uh, I don't think I'll be able to get this done tonight. I, I actually wasn't planning on uh, getting as far as I did, to be quite honest. I thought the Desert Temple was going to take a little bit longer than it did. I mean, don't hear what I'm not saying. I'm not complaining, but... Anything? No? Hi, friend. All right, I need to head north. And over the bridge and through the woods. Wait, is this the way I wanted to go? No, this is not the way I wanted to go. Eh, it's the way I'll go anyway. Gonna head to the left, up the bridge in front of the castle, over that little grass bridge to the left of the castle. And hope. Oh. Hi, friend. Yeah, I ain't playing because uh, Monsieur Bamba over there is not my friend. Although, I just realized. But now, I got the glove. Ow! That's what I get for not paying attention. I thought one of these had something special under it, no? No? Ow! All that for nothing. Took all that damage for nothing. Uh-oh. Oh. 
Hi, friend. Stay there with your buddies. There we go. Oh, wrong button. Because I still get very dyslexic on this controller. I, I have years and years and years of Nintendo memory programmed into me that uh, the A is on the right and the B is on the left. Alright, I need to head for those caves just a little bit further north. No? No. Okay. Alright, that helps. Was it over here? Nope. I already did that one. Because that's where the thing to the sanctuary was. No. Nothing special in there. Uh, I will eventually have to go through the graveyard there. And, uh, that's not going to be fun. I forgot what, uh, what the big deal with those guys were. Ow! Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Ah, I meant to pick him up. But again, I dyslexic the uh, the buttons. Let's get this guy out of the way first. Dash into the tree. Oh! Uh-oh! No! No! Uh, money? Oh, I meant to shake him down for his money. Like a good adventurer. Oh yeah, that's right. I can't do anything with that tree yet. And I'd already done... What was in here? No. Not yet. Somewhere off to the, to the left is... No. No. Although, I don't remember anybody saying anything about, uh... About that little piece of heart right there, anyway. playing your games. Game's a chance and I don't get along. Alright. Not gonna worry about that. Not gonna worry about that. I can wait. Oh man, it really bothers me because there, there should have been a... Uh, or is it a secret thing in here? See any cracks in the wall? I mean, what are the odds? Nope. I'll take those though. Okay. To the mountain. Well, at least I'm getting the money. I'm also getting hit. There we go. That's what I meant to do with him. Oh, 
no, 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 I mean, I do like having the bees handy, but, uh, yeah, that is not the bees' knees. There we go. That's got us back up to about 500 rupees. Always nice. Um... Okay. Let's uh, make our way through the cave then, shall we? Oh. I don't know who you are, but if you're going to go up the mountain, will you take me with you? I lost my lamp. Okay, old man. Uh, watch your step. There are holes in the ground. Could you turn right here, young man? Are you also going to the mountain to look for golden power? Just ahead is a mountain full of monsters. Many people have vanished. I don't want to steer you wrong, so please don't get too involved in such a mad quest. Alright, I need to go... This way-ish? Uh, turn right here. You know, I have a granddaughter who is your age. The king took her to the castle and she never returned. Kidnapping those maidens must be part of the wizard's plot. I'm sure he's trying to somehow use the power of the descendants of the wise men. Oh! Oh. Oh! Um. Well, shoot. The missing maidens are still alive somewhere. I believe that a hero will rescue them. I wait for that day. Uh. These are dangerous times. I talk too much. Anyway, thank you for your kindness to an old man like me. Uh. I wanted to give you this. If you wander into a magical transporter, gaze into this mirror. He gave you the magic mirror. This mirror is blue, clear, and beautiful. You feel like it's going to absorb you into no other world. Here, let's uh, get somewhere safe, shall we? The wizard has deceived the king, and now he is trying to open the way to the dark world. To complete your quest, you will need the Moon Pearl, which is in the tower on top of the mountain. All I can do for you now is to comfort your weariness. Come back here anytime. Ooh, that's helpful. That's also helpful. Ooh, so is that too. Alright. Uh Now I need to find my way through here. Oh, those guys. Something uh, tossing the magic powder on that area was supposed to do. I thought. I mean, all it seems to be doing is wasting my magic. Oh, I cannot get across there yet. 
There is an item I need that is located in another place. Uh, I get the feeling that's not where I wanted to be. All right, that probably takes me back to the old man's cave. And that is almost certainly back into the cave system. Okay. Ooh, I'll take that. I'm going to need the cash. Same there. Still not finding where I need to go. That was the way... That was... Yeah. That was where I just came from. Alright, let me talk to the old man again. Well, maybe deal with these guys first. Ow! Let's talk to the old man again. Wizard, yada yada. Moon pearl, yada yada. Comfort my weariness, yada yada. Ow! And he doesn't give me any magic. Okay. Okay, so... I can't get across there. Making my way up somehow. <sighs> Go away. Leave me alone. to fall into the hole in the floor. I might need to. Because I think I'm running out of caves to explore. So I guess not. Uh, that was the way back out. Alright. That is lost. Let's get back up to the old man's spot. Now I am confused. Ow.
as the old man's cave. That takes me up that way. That's another cave that I've already done, I thought. Oh, no, here we go. This cave leads to the path back to the village. Okay. So that's my cave to get all the way back. I thought... I thought there was something to do with those guys. But maybe, maybe I'm thinking wrong time. Alright. I will want that piece of heart. And I will need to do something with that tile in just a minute. Let's see if we can at least get the piece of heart. And then, uh... And then go from there. Oh. Alright, maybe I won't be able to get the piece of heart just yet. Is that gonna take me down a level? That's gonna take me down a level. Oh. Hello. Thank you. Yeah, that's right. I was gonna need one more. You caught a fairy. Keep it in a bottle. Will she leave me a message in a bottle? No. Okay. That's a different way. Ow. I hate these guys. I, I, I hate just about anything that goes with random motion. Because I just have the hardest time figuring it out. That's going to take me down there. And that's going to take me into another one of these, which I've already been, but I'll take the money. You know what? I, I might just... Uh, we'll get back to that warp tile in a little bit. Let's go through this cave. And get back to the uh, path that uh, takes us back to the village. Great googly moogly. My reflexes. That just means I need more coffee. Ow. Oh, I'm already full on arrows. But I could use that heart. Nothing. I can use that rupee. Okay, that brings me here, which will let me jump off there. Was there anything else? Okay, that's where the lumberjacks are. That's where the... The buzzard of frustration is. And this takes me to a little pool where we'll find these guys that'll bring us to different locations. Uh, well, I mean, I did eventually want to get there. Was it the same place? I forget if they take you to the same place or a random place. No, nope, same place. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. good. Let me get to... The village. Because eventually I'm going to make my way back to the lake. Where I'm going to go running around. 
picking up rupees and uh and buying more air capacity. Ow. Bum. Yeah. All right. There's going to be a lot of that going on. But in the meantime, this is probably a good safe place. Is there, is there an innkeeper around here somewhere? Yeah, over here. I may go back through and try and run around the village trying to find that stupid painting. In one of these, there's supposed to be a painting you can shake. Oh. No. I thought I could I thought I could sleep and rest and recover. Jerk. Watch, this will be it. It'll be one of those places that I that I passed all the time. Alright. Uh That is not it. Life is full. We got three bottles of fairies, which should help. Most of the way there to another life. Uh, and I wonder, does he have a... Uh, hmm. Ah, I guess I didn't need the... A little life replenishment. Is there still money in here? Because if I remember, this was a place that had the blues. Blues are nice. Yeah, I might have to spend a lot of time just running around back and forth from uh, the various money places. Alright, so... Next episode, we'll get back up to the mountain and we'll start. We'll we'll go from there. Um, we get to play with the magic mirror now. The magic mirror is what um is what you can use to travel to the dark world. This is one of the this is one of those fun little quirks that uh was unique to the Legend of Zelda. A link to the past is this whole idea of going to the dark world and then back to the light world and, and realistically speaking it's this map with a dark overlay because systems limitations of the time although I, I I think that actually adds something useful to it it also means that some areas like the monolith and the desert that we weren't able to get to before because the terrain is slightly different in the dark world and the light world you can do stuff like travel to the dark world move to a different location, and then travel to the light world. We're going to start running into tiles like the ones that I'm going to show off more in the next episode where where you, you go to a tile, warp over to the dark world, travel to where you need to go. You can use the mirror to get back. All sorts of, all sorts of new mechanics open up now for us to use in getting from one place to another. Um... But that's going to have to wait until the next episode for now. It's time to do something different. Well, that was fun. And I hope you had fun too. Next episode should roll out tomorrow, unless tomorrow is a live stream day. Current schedule is over on my Twitch profile. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already, follow me there. You'll get notified when I go live. And you'll be able to chat along as we record the next six episodes. You'll also be able to join along for some of the other stuff I do on Twitch. It's all up there on the channel. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel here. It really helps out. If you click the bell, you get notified of all the other stuff that goes up on the channel as well. 
like Coffee Craft Livestream Archives, Future Games Revisited Episodes, and uh, various other stuff that strikes my fancy. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, quips, queries, quotes, comments, complaints, or quibbles, leave them in the comments below. Have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.